Hey guys, I'm just doing a quick step back in the Jones Zone. <clears throat> Look, there's a lot of New Age scholars deceiving people on YouTube, and this is something that's been going on for a while now, actually. What they're doing is they're trying to sow the seeds of doubt in Christians by coming up with alternative narratives, like the Epic of Gilgamesh predating Noah and the and the flood, and then you have these black Kimites saying that the 42 laws of Ma'at, uh, whatever that is, predated the Bible. In which case, that may be true textually, but before the word was written, it was with God in the beginning. All right, this is this is a spiritual thing we're talking about here. So, and what I mean by that is that for a lot of people, you should understand that uh, many Christians. That is, the spiritual reality has precedence over the mundane reality. Okay, so when these New Agers and these false religion people come at you with that crap about uh, anything predating the Bible, okay, you counter with John chapter 1 verse 1. In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. All right? So, how could the prophets and the apostles copy something that was already with God in the beginning? They didn't. They received the word directly from God. The copycats are Satan and his fallen angels who knew the word before they were cast out of heaven. Satan was a cherub, and many of them were tasked with guarding Eden from things leaving and coming in. And then, when he fell... He and his angels went about constructing these little narratives about Sumerians and the, the Canaanite gods and the Olympians and all the rest of it. So again, if someone comes at you with that, this text uh, predated uh, the Bible and technically blah, 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 and all this kind of stuff narrative, then you just tell them, in the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God, and that will shut them down. Alright, that's all I have to say. Now have a blessed day.